Hello everybody, JVC1103 here, welcome back to some more NASCAR Heat 3, we're returning back to our championship mode with the NASCAR Capable Truck Series 12 race schedule, and we're going to race 8 of 12, we're going to the last great coliseum, Bristol Motor Speedway. Yep. It's time. <laughs> ah, the actual paved version. Oh boy. It's been a pretty interesting championship so far. Five wins out of the seven we've done so far. And we're getting to the kind of the, the ending of the season. Got a little bit over a race lead right now. But we still got some races that could kind of put a monkey wrench in the championship if we're not careful. Let's see if we can improve our qualifying position. Definitely, we're going to be good to go on the field here. The question is, can the tires last the pounding? As you can see, Just it's like already it's at rest. 98. Yeah, here we go. Bristol is kind of better than it was in NASCAR 2, but Bristol felt like Dalton, it would destroy the tires. The lights would be gone. Alrighty. <coughs> Excuse me. Alrighty. <coughs> oh no. Nah. That was a bad one. And no water in sight. Just gonna have to deal with it, sadly. At least this is a short race. With 13%, should be 26 laps. Our right front may be killed by the end, but. Telemarketers, seriously? Let's do this. Draw clear up top. You only get so much time to record. <laughs> yeah. I guess that we're doing a thirteen percent championship. Fifty laps here with times three times we were ain't bad. Cause like I said, the tire wear in NASCAR he too, oh boy. Oh that was just it just destroyed the tires. This is one of those strikes where it just really hurts in that game. This game, a little bit more improvement. NASCAR Heat 4 and 5, it's a lot better there, also being able to have adjust, having setups as well, to aid some of the issues as well, so we won't have this tight condition going forward in the next two games. But overall, I'm a very huge fan of Heat 2 through 5. Even though I know what happened with Heat 5. And I don't really enjoy NASCAR Heat Evolution. But I would rather play NASCAR Heat Evolution than play NASCAR 21 Ignition. 
and do you techniques NASCAR games. That's the best way to, you know, understand how I feel about the current NASCAR games that have happened out in the recent years. Hi, Greenfield. I'm guessing Greenfield cannot wait to go to Talladega. Unfortunately, Talladega is a couple of races away. <laughs> we got Texas before that. And we're going to have the road course at Moorsport. Which I sadly think due to since COVID, I don't think we're going to Moorsport this year. It's kind of a sad rear. Really. Don't want to hit Fort Moore. Right, Fort Moore, please. Uh oh, now we're in trouble. Now we're going to drop up here. Uh, oh, we made the shoot in the middle. We're we'll shooting in the middle. Thank you. Very much appreciated, boys. Alrighty then. Yeah, this is the one thing about 28 degree Bristol. Yeah, I said 28 degree Bristol. I really miss the old 36 degrees. That baby was steep. Heck, even 30 degree Bristol was better than this. There's nothing to complain about. That's called heat too was under 20 degree Bristol, but it just feels so weird. Right, careful now, still there. That's the halfway mark here. Clear all around. How's the tire wear? Oh! <laughs> Right <laughs> front. Oh my god. <laughs> it's a loose ain't kill me now. Kill me. Oh. Ooh. <laughs> if this doesn't show why. Oh my gosh, man. Just wear at least 15% less. Oh my gosh. I think it's gonna last, but barely. Oh, so just in here, my bad. Oh, excuse me, Greenfield. I'm gonna lap you again. I think we're just gonna destroy the field today. <laughs> Don't mind me. I'm just. One away. <laughs> Gotta say, these last couple of races, Johnny Sauter has been kind of choking in more ways than one. Look, never mind, there he is. Finally making it into the top five. Excuse me, Ben Rhodes. We may be leaving here with a 60 point lead. The way this is going. And if we leave here with a 60 point lead, we, 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 we may almost got this wrapped up. Stay low. Right, careful now. Still there. All right, now you're clear. But most put is going to be a little bit of a challenge next time out. Clear all around. And then, yeah, honey. We got Talladega. And then Texas. And then we own, we end this little championship in Homestead. Still there. Oh, we're just going through the traffic now. All right, clear outside. Five to go. You got this. Oh, what just happened? Gave the one little kit. No, two oh, kisses. Right. Stay up high. Stay high. Hang tight there, driver. Hold this line here. Oh! Oh! Right, we 
Wave this guy's off. Caution. Uh, wow, we was actually involved in a caution. Okay. It's been a long time since an AI has crashed and I've been a part of it. A very long time. I know we got damage, but I am not pitting. We're almost to the end of this race. Oh, and that, that was a race ender. Ooh. And, wow, well, I ain't gonna even completely read the service max of that lap. No, sir. I want my lead back. White flag on this overtime. And if I do. And I'm gonna read correct news. This is our first overtime of the year. Back it down, back it down. Don't worry. I know. Number one, baby. Woohoo! Six winning the season. And we gotta save the engine. <laughs> oh boy. But we won at Bristol. Yes. I think Matt Craven's gonna have a terrible seat year. Oh boy. What's our top ten gonna look like now? Yep. 60 points. 61 to be precise. <laughs> and we get all the winners in the top 10. As one victory lane for the sixth time. But that race is lead right now. It's going to be very important to keep that up right now. With just a third of the season to go. Just one lap short of completely leading the complete race. Thanks, Max. Greatly appreciated. No, I shouldn't complain. In the day we got the win. And that's going to be our short tracks done. Now we go to our one and only road course of the year. And we're going up to the maple part of the world. The great north. We're going to Canada. Motorsport. The newly owned Canadian tire Motorsport. But that will be next time everybody. But before then. Let's look at the point standings for the complete field. Yeah, Parker Kilgore's moving up. Just 10 points out of 29th. And 25 points out of 28th. Still a lot. Still some time for Parker to at least get himself into 25th. Maybe a little higher. Oh, well. Until next time, everybody, this has been JVC1103. Thanks for watching.
like comment and if you did enjoy what you saw today consider subscribing for more gameplay content racing and non-racing here on the channel but until we continue this championship in the truck series i hope all y'all have a safe day and peace